Hey my little jelly babes, I hope you're all well. So I am just continuing to review these beautiful plates that have been sent to me very kindly from Marianne Nails. And I am so excited to show you this plate today. It is absolutely gorgeous. It's like got everything that I love in a plate. So you can see it's got beautiful butterflies, the bird cage, and that image right there with the, the lady with the butterfly dress. I love it even more for um, an extra reason. It's exactly like my phone case. It's so pretty. I was like, as soon as I saw the plate, I was like, I've so, so got to get it. It's beautiful. So yeah, so, so many pretty images. You've got the butterflies, the bird cage, the birds. This really beautiful, delicate, um, big butterfly here. Absolutely beautiful. And I, as, as with all the other reviews, I am using this fabulous stamper that was also sent for Maria Nels for review. So I'm doing my much love technique at the moment. I'm absolutely, I just love how uh, this makes <coughs> an image turn out. I mean, look how cool that has blended the colors. Just gonna get it on here. So how pretty is that? But it didn't have the antenna things on, so I swatched it again. So beautiful. Really, really love that. So I am so in love with this place. Like if you're obsessed with butterflies like I am, you're gonna love it too. There are so many adorable images. And like even though it's just like the one butterfly, you could just totally have that on your nails by itself. It's just so pretty. And I think this is really a, a, quite a really nice, unique image as well. So obviously you've got the, like, the really nice delicate butterfly at the end and oh, just amazing. Just look how beautiful it looks. So this image right here is quite cool. Like if, if you've got like, if you're a lady with long nails, you could almost have that like on the end of your nail, like a bit of a pretty French tip. I'll just swatch it dead quick for you. To show you what I mean. So like seriously if you had that going across all of your nails how pretty would that look? But I kind of did it again and did it down the nail just because it, this is obviously a longer pop stick and um, I just felt like that looked better. So I'm getting this absolutely amazing beautiful bird cage here and with the hollow that shines through how gorgeous does that swatch look? Okay, so I'm just gonna get this. I'm gonna try, like if there's little images, if I can, I'm gonna try and put like more than one image across of across the plate. Okay, so on this same pop stick, I'm gonna put this bigger bird on there, but just in white. Try not to get the rest of the stuff on the swatch as well. So how pretty is that with the beautiful birds? And this is beautiful as well. And what's nice is you could have like, you've got this swatch here, which you can put on your nail. And then on the opposite side of the plate, you've got it, but in the opposite direction. So if you wanted this just as a really nice, pretty accent nail, you can do it for both of the nails um, with relative ease. So I, I'm trying to get this to look like how it does on my phone case. But you can see there, like, because it's a bit of a solid image, like you need to scrape it a couple of ways and it just didn't work and the colors didn't shine show up as well so a little bit gutted but with this with the solid image you kind of needed to scrape it more than just across once uh, which wouldn't allow with the um, blending of the two colors but it's still pretty we look at that it's gorgeous with the beautiful lilac glitter anyway so it turned out all right in the end so i'm going to get this um, right in here which you can see again has swatched amazingly it's picked up really really well and then because it says butterfly kisses I'm gonna add this real pretty butterfly at the bottom of the nail how adorable so you've got this vine type of image here it's like a butterfly vine which would be the prettiest vine in the world okay so that's like 
but I know that's difficult for you guys to pick up so I am gonna put a black over it and I'm gonna use my fabulous uh, rainbow connection one which has picked up lovely so that's good to know as well you can use other stampers with these plates so it's really it was really difficult to see as in because the color was so light I couldn't quite pinpoint where it should go and I actually thought it would be better if I put the colors on the other way around so I've already done the black and then I'm going to put the green over the top for like a shadow effect okay so you can see here you can see much better where it's meant to go I've not done this technique before how cool does that look I know it's not like perfect but for my first attempt I love that I love that shadow effect that's awesome so here are all the swatches all together for you guys that one there is definitely a favorite and that beautiful butterfly one and the princess dress as well absolutely awesome swatches so I really hope you enjoyed watching my review of this plate and thank you so much for checking it out and make sure you come back tomorrow for the last review of the last plate that's been sent to me okay bye